What's up guys, this is Two Bucks, and this video will teach you how to use the shop commands on Minecraft 500. We've recently switched our shop mod from simple shop to better shop. So the command uh, that you have to type in is slightly different now, so I thought I'd make this video to avoid any confusion. Before I made the video, I'd like to show you guys a couple more things that we've been doing on the server, just so that, you know, keeps the video a bit interesting. Over here, uh, we've set the spawn area to under that little hub thing right there. That's where I began the video. Right when you get out of the spawn, you have four paths that you can choose from, each leading you to a different place, such as like the uh, exit of the town, we have the marketplace, we have the museum, and we have some uh, cool nightlife going on over here. So uh, a nice little hub there to direct you. And uh, Puego is nice enough to build this, this like abstract art thing on top of it that looks really sweet. We have some uh, statues of people that are cool. Oh, we got this uh, female gamer actually working on it right now. Working on this statue of somebody. Not even sure who that is. And Potato is watching with his creepy mustache. And of course you have the statue of me. The Statue of Liberty right there. And Mark who is uh, in ball and chains because he is a molester. Alright, here we have our builder, Emin, currently working on something, and he messed up. Somehow, there is a huge lava fold now, so we will execute him. Got the pissing sheep. <laughs> Always gotta love that. Here we're working on a ice hockey rink built by Agent. The stands and stuff still in construction, but looks pretty accurate to me. Got this ballin' ass nightclub. Built by Mike1669. This is going to be uh, absolutely popping. It's got the DJ booth up here. Probably get some stripper poles going. Pretty classy shiznat. So uh, obviously a full extended server tour will be uploaded soon to gameplays. Alright, let's get to the better shop mod, shall we? So there are four commands that you guys will need to know for the better shop mod. The first thing you want to know is uh, how to check what items are for sale. Simply type slash shop list. This will bring up uh, a list of things that are for sale. There are six pages, so to see a full list, you're going to have to do shop list page two, shop list three, etc. You can go by this rule of thumb. Every single raw material on the server is purchasable. Raw material means the absolute most rawest version of that material. For example, you can't buy gold blocks, you can't buy gold ingots, you have to buy gold ores. We like to do this because it's kind of fun to have to, you know, cook your own gold and stuff. We don't want to take away the entire Minecraft experience. So you do have to cook your own gold. When you buy coal, you have to buy coal that comes in the block, you have to chop it down yourself. And we think that uh, adds a bit to the fun. Instead of just letting you guys buy the, uh, the gold blocks itself, you know, where's the fun in that? So that is the first good rule of thumb. Second good rule of thumb is that you cannot sell non-renewable items. In other words, you can only sell animal products and agricultural products. This is because we don't really want people going mining just for money. That'll tear up the terrain of the server too quickly and leave us kind of barren. And so in two months, our entire server resources will be empty. We kind of want people mining just for fun rather than for money. So you can only sell renewable resources. Once again, you know, crops, trees, animal type stuff. And monster stuff, obviously. So those two rules will basically tell you what's on sale and what's not on the server. But if you still want to know, shop list. If you want to check if a specific item is for sale, you can just do slash shop check gold. And it will tell you that gold ore is for sale. So this mod is a bit better than our old one, Simple Shop. It's a bit more user friendly. And I would recommend having the Minecraft data values page open up when you're trying to use shop because sometimes you don't really know what exactly they're called and the data values can help. I'll uh, put a link to data values and the complete list of Minecraft items in a link below. So now that you know what you want to buy and sell, how exactly do you do it? Very simple. To buy, you just do slash shop buy. You put the item name right there, and you put the amount right after it. 
For example, if we want to buy logs and we want to buy 10 of them, just type 17, 10. That'll buy you 10 logs. Or slash shop by log 10. You can either use the code or the name of the item. Either way, it'll get you 10 logs. What if you want to sell? Slash shop sell log 10. Once again, it's slash shop sell item name followed by the amount. So, of course, we could also do the data value, which is 17, 10. Both of them serve the same purpose. Either way, we can buy and sell logs. All right, so uh, very simple to use and uh, go make some money. By the way, the tip of the day, now that we have wolves, it's very easy to kill monsters for money. So if you're a wolf type person, I would get five or six wolves, go out at night, dominate some skeletons, some spiders and stuff, and sell that shiznat for a large profit. All right, enjoy playing on the server, guys. And for those of you who aren't on the server, feel free to check out our server. Um, there's a link to sign up, minecraft500.com. All right, see you guys.